Okay, so it's almost 12.30 on February 12th, and Andrew and I have done so many errands this morning. We washed some clothes, we did a whole bunch of things. Um, Annabelle's actually coming home today, so we're probably gonna head over there this evening to say hello. She's been gone for a while, and I haven't seen her since mid-December, actually. So we're gonna go over there tonight, but I'm getting a little bit hungry after doing all this er these errands, so. I'm gonna open up this durian that I have. Look at how beautiful. So I've been letting it thaw out because we bought it at the Asian market and they, they do freeze them. So I've been, I left it out overnight so that it could be nice and warm because obviously it's cold out. Um, so I didn't want to put it in the, freeze, the fridge or anything. I wanted to really make sure it was like warm or room temperature. So I'm so, so excited to eat this. Um, and maybe I'll op I'll do a video of how I open it because some people can pry it open because they know where the seams are. I always have a tr I always find it difficult to find where the seams are, and I, t I tend to use a knife. Um, that way, maybe I could show you if you've never seen a durian, you've never had a durian. That way, you can see what it looks like. All right, so I'll keep you posted. All right, so I'm finally opening the durian. We still have a lot of things we have to put away, but I want to just take a little break and have my first meal. That's really spiky. It's so spiky, I don't know if you can see. But they're really, really spiky. Can you see that? Sometimes, like, we'll see if I can open it. If I can't, I'll have Andrew assist me here. Durian is such a cool fruit. Um, it has like these separate little, let's see. Sometimes you can see, but it has like these separate little pods. And then it has um, like little sections and then separate pods within the section. So I'm just gonna use a knife. Um, Cause for me that's easier. Cause they're so spiky. And sometimes I find the seam, but most of the times I don't. And I just kind of cut it and see. I don't think I got this thing, but at least I can get it open, I think. See, I'm close here, you can see that. Once I can get one open, then it's a little easier for me to get the other one. I think I'm off by just a little bit, you know? Okay. Andrew, do you want to help me? Okay, let's switch. So Andrew's gonna take over. Also behind here are our tinctures. I don't know if you can see. The A's are for Andrew's and then mine are in the back there from what I have left over from when I did mine. Uh, I'm gonna be using them soon because I'm doing a nine day fast too. But anyway, Oh, see, yeah, it's just off by a little bit. Look at that. So you see how there's like, these are like each individual pods. Do you see? They're like a little pod. Let's see. see what they look like. So. Andrew was able to find the scene after he opened that one up. This is one of the reasons why I want to go to Thailand or, um, you know, Philippines or, or even Hawaii because there's so much durian and it's fresh, it's not frozen. So. Thank you so much, Andrew. So 
are delicious. So obviously, this is a really big durian, and I'm probably not gonna be able to finish all of this for sure. But I might do two meals, like one one now and one later, even though I have some greens that are soaking. Uh, but I really, really want a durian. I'm so, 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 so grateful that we can get durian here in the Northeast. Um, so I'm gonna give it a try. It smells really good. It's like so, it's like, I don't know if you can see this here. Let's see. Like when you open it, it's like creamy, you know? It's like so creamy. Can you see that? Nope. So creamy. Big one. Oh my gosh. I haven't had durian in so long. It's so good. It's just like so creamy and sweet and it's so funny because it smells it has such a very, it has a very interesting smell. I remember when I first tried durian, it was like onion and garlic, but kind of sweet, but the texture was like, I don't know, I didn't really like the texture, but now I love it. It's so creamy. One day, I'm gonna be able to try durian fresh. I cannot wait. But this will do for now. Thanks for watching. Okay, okay. So I'm really excited because I'm about to eat the rest of the durian. Durian, so good, so good. Anyway, um, I'm also really excited because we have two shelves installed up here in the loft and we installed, installed two more shelves downstairs. Hold on one second. Got to argue so we installed two shelves up here and two shelves downstairs in the kitchen. So I haven't worked on the kitchen shelves yet, but I've been working uh, on the shelves here. Let me show you. So amazing, right? So we have some instruments, some books, some DVDs, just like fun movies and camera stuff. You can see our window again. There's Andrew with our other storage up there. And we have a printer now. Oh my gosh. Everything is just like crazy day. I'm so excited. And we just got a whole bunch of books. And I'm so excited to read them. And I have a lot of books that I want to read. And I'm really excited. And I'm really motivated to learn and read things now. But anyway, I am having my last meal of the day. It's around 4.30, I'm a little hungry. I also wanna to go to bed early today, so I wanna eat earlier than I did yesterday. Um, and Andrew's fasting now, so, you know, I can share juice while, you know, juice with him while I'm eating, but he already finished his juice, so. It's just me eating some durian, um, but I'm really excited. And then I think tomorrow I'm gonna to have the prunes. Um, I haven't had a bowel movement today, but I did go twice yesterday, so I'm really excited about that. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, I will show you soon what books I received uh, in the mail today, um, but that will be at a later video, or like what my current reads are, I think. 
Um, I'll do a video about what I'm currently wanting to read, what I'm currently reading. Um, yeah, I think that's it for today. If you like these videos, please give them a thumbs up, comment below, and also subscribe if you want to see more things like this. Um, and we would love to hear from you though with those comments. Please let us know if you're liking these videos, if you want more information, if you have questions, anything like that would be greatly appreciated. And we would love to answer your questions, engage with you guys. Um, but thank you so, so, so much for watching. Um, and I hope you have a wonderful last meal of the day. Mm. So good. Oh my gosh, this one is so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Earth. Thank you, farmers. Thank you, everyone, for giving me this food. Oh, thank you, thank you. All right, so Andrew and I are gonna be heading over to Andrew's parents' house, but before we go, I'm gonna open up a coconut with our Coco Jack. Coco Jack. It came with this like little case because we got the, the one with the super outer little tool to scoop out the coconut meat which we haven't used yet but it's okay I really love coconuts. Um, they're just so tasty and hydrating and full of vitamins and minerals. All those good things. And then you get a bonus of the coconut meat, meat which I think I'm actually going to save all the coconut meat that I'm going to be opening from coconuts. And I think the plan for me is to freeze it because then you can use coconut meat to make like frosties and stuff like that. Um, so yeah. Okay, let's see. Hmm? No, that's clean. and leaking. <sighs> That's Baby, what? could you take this cutting board with you as well? What? Could you take this cutting board with you as well? Yeah. All right. So that was a little bit rough. The coconut actually split down the side, which is fine. I mean, it's still salvageable. Um, but I put it in a bowl instead of a glass, or just using a straw to drink it. This one is like not opening. So good.